as I mentioned in last week's vlog, uh, I am heading out to Summer Madness Truck Run this weekend. Uh, I just went and got food for the weekend. And now I am going to go get my hair cut. I got to go home and uh, make a new piece for the kid size picnic table to replace the one that I put too many holes in. Uh, the lady's going to come by and pick that up this morning uh, as I sold it on Facebook. And then I'm going to head up to Bakersfield for, like I said, the Summer Madness Truck Run. Um, I'll tell you more about it as we go. And it is time for a haircut. There we go. Haircut is done. Literally took about 10 minutes. So I made this picnic table. I accidentally got this end piece here with the notches and put it on the side right here. So now it has an extra eight holes in it. So the lady is paying 75 bucks for this thing. So I think uh, she should get one without extra holes in the side. So I'm gonna cut that and put it on real quick. checking in tonight letting you guys know how everything's going um, I'm usually up till three or four in the morning you know having a good time drinking a little hanging out with my friends and then I stumble into my tent get a few hours sleep and start all over again two hours in just hitting the uh, grapevine and one more hour to go well, I'm here. It's a bit of a line. They got to search your vehicle when you come in. Make sure you don't have any blatantly illegal uh, weapons. And I'll go find my campsite. ready to go so yes yes this giant ass tent is just for me and that's how I like it 
I got easy up we'll put up tomorrow and then I've got a chair and a little table fold up and when it gets late at night I put those in here with me like I said earlier I'll go out drinking hanging out doing whatever till three or four in the morning come in here pass out and I'm good to go till you know nine or ten o'clock Like I said, I will walk around just like this, talking to the camera, doing whatever at the show, and come over. And earlier, I was doing this, <laughs> and then I creeped up on uh, Sophia and waited for her to notice that I was there. But you know, you I fell right here. I was like, whoa. <laughs> It's about a quarter to 11. 
and I just realized that I haven't eaten dinner yet. So I came over to the taco stand and it looks like they are getting everything ready to start cooking. So hopefully 10, 15 minutes I'll be eating here. About 11 o'clock, right? I got an asada burrito with everything on it, and I'm looking forward to eating this. New floor, got a dozen of them. I don't trust you, you are undercover. I could probably make some steps, this is for each other. Talking fillets with the truck and butter. Fresh sheets and towels, man, she got a love. I haven't been in my camp since 6, so I figured I'd go and check and see how my tent's doing. Let's go see how the main strip looks. Can't tell if there's anybody at the stage. We're gonna go up on stage. Come on. Come on. Hi, Boo. Hi, Boo. Never mind, we're going up there. That's my cousin. shows no sign of lightening up. The DJ's done for the night, but the cruising's still going on, and there's a long ass line to get in.
It is now 2.30 a.m. And I want to say I got about a half hour left in me. I'm going to go crash out in my tent. But uh, everything's still going strong. Most of these guys will be going until the sun comes up. I'm not quite young enough to do that anymore. Finally time for me to go pass out. Start it all again in the morning. So good night everybody. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you next time.